theater room, guys. Got a box of coach? Yes, yeah. sir. All right, Coach Daryl Brooks here with Mod Wilson, Michael Briscoe. Uh, first of all, I'm, I'm just really thankful to God for this opportunity to coach this basketball team. Um, it's my alma mater, uh, and, I'm, and I'm really, really proud of these guys. We, we had tremendous effort this year, and it wasn't always easy for us this year. Uh, as far as today's game, I, I thought to, to keep it nice and simple, we got beat by a better, the better team today. Uh, they were terrific in their pressure. Uh, they were relentless on the glass, and they shot the ball. You know, they were 11 for 32, but uh, that's how they play. And they made big threes at big times. We'd, we'd make a run, and they'd, we'd turn the ball over or make a three. And, and, and I thought that, uh, you know, they just did a terrific job. So I really want to tip uh, our hats to them, their coaching staff. They did a great job today. Questions? Coach, how much different this time around uh, compared to the, the bout here in November? You know, I, I thought that was, a, it was a, both teams were kind of different. It was the second game of the year. Uh, he was filling out his lineup. We were filling out ours. We had some injuries. We had a couple of kids that didn't even play in that game. So, you know, I just thought both of us got better. Um, they're number one team in the country for a reason. Uh, but, but again, I, I thought that was the difference. It was an early season game, and we were both kind of figuring each other out and, and, and not taking anything away from my basketball team. I thought we played a, a really good game that day. Coach, you had a nice run to end the season. Talk a little bit about that. You know, all, all, all season long, even when we were losing tough games, we felt like we kept saying to these guys, we hadn't played our best basketball yet. And I think unless you're a bad basketball team, you're going to have that kind of a run somewhere in your season. Uh, we, we felt like we were a good team. And in the last couple of weeks, last two and a half, three weeks of the season, we felt like we were, you know, we were getting to that point. And I think when, when these guys beat Virginia State at Virginia State, who's one of the, the best teams to not make this tournament, uh, we really felt like we were in that, in that mode, in that groove. Tough was it too? Um, you know, they run players and players. Their depth is pretty good. It's pretty quality depth. You know, Cantrell comes in and gets nine and eight. Uh, the Stockman kid can hit the three. You know, how tough is that to defend that? That you know, when they sub out, you're getting good players coming in. Uh, it's extremely tough. You know, that's a great basketball team, and that's a, a cha championship caliber team, and that's what you got to have to be a championship team. So you know, it was tough for us. You know. But um, I think we fought hard. Um, just a, a, a great basketball team, great basketball club. You got in two runs changed that game. The 15-2 run early in the game when they got control of the game, and then you come, you fight your way back, you get back within six, 48-42, and then in less than a minute they score eight points to go back up 14. And you, know, you guys didn't quit, but those two things had to be frustrating. Very, <laughs> very. Yeah, we we felt like you know we were right there. It was six, you know, six point game and. We kept saying to them, I thought we quick shot. You know, we, when we ran half court offense, we had success. And they forced 20 turnovers, but our bad shots, our quick shots were like turnovers. So we really, we might have had 30 turnovers because we just, we took some quick shots and we kind of got out of the pace that we wanted to play at. And, and, and again, credit them. They, they come at you all the time and they, they force you sometimes to kind of play faster than you want to play. And I think that's part of their game plan. Thank you. Thank you.